First ensure you are connected to CCCHS in the Wi-Fi menu. Open Safari. In the search bar, type b i t dot l y forward slash c c c h s i t. Make sure the c c c h s i t is in capital letters. Sign in using your school credentials. You can save your password or click not now. On the Managed Software Center page, scroll down and look for a blue download link and click it. On the new page that has opened, click Download. Another page will open. Click Download anyway. In the pop-up window click Allow to start the download. The DMG file will save to your Downloads folder. Click your Downloads folder on your dock, then click the downloaded DMG file to open it. In the window that opens, you need to right-click the icon and select Open. To right-click, hold the Control key and click. If you do not right-click, you will not be able to open it. In the pop-up window click Open again. In the Installer window, click Continue. Next click Install. Type in your user password, you need to be an administrator, now click Install. You will see notifications on the right, you can close these by hovering over them and clicking the X. To finish the install click Restart, then click Move to bin in the pop-up window that appears. When your computer restarts, at the login window you will see the Managed Software Center, Installing, this is normal, do not click Cancel. When the installing is complete, you can sign in. When your desktop loads you will see several notifications, this is normal, you can close them. You will also see the Zscaler Client Connector open. Click Accept on the Zscaler Client Connector. You will need to sign in using your school credentials. Click the Remember Me box then sign in. You have now correctly installed the MSC and set up your laptop to use the internet at school. When your computer restarts, at the login window you will see the Managed Software Center, Installing, this is normal, do not click Cancel. When the installing is complete, you can sign in. When your desktop loads you will see several notifications, this is normal, you can close them. You will also see the Zscaler Client Connector open. Click Accept on the Zscaler Client Connector. You will need to sign in using your school credentials. Click the Remember Me box then sign in. You will now be correctly signed into the Wi-Fi 